last year on tour and uh, there was a guy at the back of the CD cube and he had his Cole Clark guitars case and he got to the front and he opened it up and he had one of my signature guitars in there and as I went to sign it, his wife said, can you believe how lucky he was to win that guitar? I thought, that doesn't sound right. If they gave one away, they probably would have told me. She said, six weeks ago, he bought himself a $5,000 Gibson guitar. He's already got 20 guitars at home. He can't play them very well. We haven't got the money. We had a huge argument, a big fight. I threatened to leave him and he promised me he was not going to buy any more bloody guitars. <laughs> then last week, he was at the pub, bought one raffle ticket, wins your guitar. <laughs> now, I, this, is, this is a true thing about Australia. In a pub raffle, the prize is usually a tray of raw meat. Right? It's called the meat raffle. And it is absolutely as disgusting as it sounds. It is literally the butcher, the local butcher walks around with blood on him, selling tickets to win meat. Uh, sometimes you win money, sometimes you win beer, usually meat, almost never a $4,000 guitar. It's extremely rare. And uh, so he was giving me the international look of the bro, which all men have given and received is this look. <laughs> I don't know this man and his marriage is his business, but there's something in my DNA. I don't know what it is, it's, it's, it's just a dude thing that as soon as I see that look, I'm instantly willing to lie for him. So there was one second between the look and me saying, oh, you're the guy who won that guitar in the pub raffle. I read about you. Congratulations. <laughs> so, and he gave the other look. Oh, we all give each other gents. This one. <laughs> and I signed his guitar. And as he was walking away, I sort of pointed to the merchandise table. And I said, um, not buying any albums tonight. He said, Lloyd, I've got all nine of your albums. I've got the signature model guitar, the signature model stomp, the signature model caper, I've got the vinyls, I've got the t-shirts, I've got the DVDs, I've got everything you've ever done. I said, that's fantastic, thank you. I think you need them again. <laughs> anyway, uh, spent 350 bucks on merchandise to save his marriage. And he thinks it's over. My yeah, next album's gonna cost him 370 bucks.
aquí va. 